You know, folks, I did a video on this um, several weeks ago, if not a couple months, but I just wanted to do a quick video here talking about the fact that uh, now that all the girls know that Zach may not be the baby daddy, that, you know, there is no longer that 100% guarantee that, um, or excuse me, that 100% certainty that Karen was so show that Zach was the father my question is this, who is going to tell Zach that, hey, guess what? Karen was wrong in saying that you are the father because the timeline that, you know, she was given shows that it might not be your child. And the thing is, it's kind of like the whole keep that same energy. I think I saw a tweet or a message a while ago about how it's funny how many times Karen is so has shown that when she is, you know, show something is a, a certain way, she will be so loud about it. She'll make all these declarations. But when it turns out she and then she ends up being wrong and embarrassed. I mean, it's kind of like the whole her uh, telling see uh, t telling Danny. Yeah, go ahead. Laugh at me. Laugh at me. I know that's what you're doing. But it's like, well, I mean. Think of it this way. You made a damn fool out of yourself, a complete idiot out of yourself at the penthouse when you called the girls meeting and you wanted Fatima to come in order to hurt her. You admitted to that, to hurt her by telling her that you're pregnant with uh, Zach's baby. But it's like, oh, I already knew you were pregnant. Zach already told me. And it's like, yeah, you did that to yourself. Now that your little facade, your charade has been exposed in that, okay, um, he might not be the baby. Daddy, now you look stupid and then you want to talk about how it's so confusing, confusing, confusing and whatnot with Aaron. It's like, no, nah, man, you did that to yourself. And it's like, how, how, how did I get into this mess? Because you were sleeping around? <laughs> um... And I love how people are like, man, how come you don't talk about other characters who sleep around like, you know, Karen, look at Andy and Danny and whatnot. But as far as we know in the show, n none of them are pregnant. So I can't really talk about them, you know, talk, you know, in, in the context of they wonder how they ended up pregnant. Yeah, because you're sleeping around like a hoe. Um, only Karen has been confirmed to be pregnant. And don't get me wrong. As soon as Danny or Andy are confirmed to be pregnant, they'll get the same treatment. So... I'm an equal opportunity commentator. Huh. But in any case, Sabrina on multiple occasions has blabbed about Zach's address, the amount of money Zach has in his bank account. So I don't know if Zach comes into paint in the bank. Will she blab to him about that? Nope. Any news that might actually be helpful to him to know, nobody's going to tell him. But when it's news that might be detrimental to him or exposing, hey, Zach got this money. Oh, Zach got locked up. They'll talk that crap to the other women. But when it's anything that could help Zach out, they aren't going to say that. You know, it's like um, Zach called out, Danny, you're only here to probe and get information and then go back to your little sister's click. But I ain't, no, that ain't happening here. I ain't got nothing to say. I mean, what about Andy? Given that she knows the situation about Zach not being the baby daddy, possibly. We know at the end of the last week's episode, she found out about the whole child support thing of Zach possibly being the father of a child, a three-year-old boy. So I'm wondering, will Andy be the one? I think out of all the characters, it should in fact be Karen, but I doubt she's going to do it. In episode 20, it's like the synopsis. She um, decides to express to Zach how she genuinely feels, but I'm wondering, will she mention that he might not be the baby daddy? I'm going to say no, because let's say if Karen shows up at the house and talks to Zach, what will happen is he's, as expected, will say, well, I don't even want to say reject her, but... At the same time, say that Zach is just going to say what he's always said. Karen, please let this go. It's not going to happen between us. And she's just going to still string along the fact that, well, I'm carrying your child, so you're still going to see me whether you like it or not. 
I feel like she'll do some shit like that. Look, if she does say you might not be the father, I will give credit where credit is due, but something tells me she won't do it. Now, how about Danny? Why don't she run her ass up in the house like she did last time? You know, I think the baby's yours, Zach, and I think you know it's yours too. Why don't you run over there and say, hey, turns out you might not be the father, so there's that. Maybe she'll move on. No, she's not going to do that. She's not going to do that. Because all these sisters love is chaos. They have the little sister circle meetings to try to help, but it's all about drama, chaos, and keeping. It's like, you know what, not one sister can have a, you know, uh, I guess you could say a good day because they, it's like if one of them is miserable, they want to make sure everybody else is miserable. And that's really how it goes. So do you think, Zach will find out that there is a chance he is not the baby daddy. I think it doesn't matter whether or not somebody tells him because Fatima is going to for show sure have that DNA test once that child is born and then we'll put it into all this. But you know what? I, I To Karen's credit, I do hope that she does tell Zach before the end of the season, but something tells me that she won't. And, you know, we'll go from there. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Hit like and subscribe, and uh, I'll catch you all in the next one.